Okay, we just embedded the Wikipedia page using the iframe tag, and next we're going to embed a tweet. So, iframes are often used to embed tweets into web pages. This allows news stories to embed tweets right into the story, so readers can see how Twitter is reacting to a particular event. Here's an example from the New York Times. Okay, so this is the ad bird color bot, and basically each tweet from this account is a bird name followed by a swath of colors that resemble a paint chip. Each band's width is determined by the probability of a given bird of that species being that color. Okay, so pretty cool for all of you nature geeks out there. All right, so these are all the colors that rock pigeons could possibly be. The larger the width, the more likely it is going to be that color. So it looks like gray and black and brown are the more likely colors for this. Anyway, the Exercise is this. We are going to go to this tweet, okay, computing ideas, and I went ahead and opened that up in a new tab, and we're going to embed a tweet from this web page, okay? So you can click on the more arrow and then embed tweet, and basically it's going to give us the code that we need. All right, this is a similar process to things like embedding videos from YouTube or other video streaming sites or like buttons from Facebook or other social media platforms. The idea is to make the content from those sites accessible off their platforms and to drive more traffic back to those platforms. All right, so let's get started. You are going to put your code in the body. So let's go over and grab that code from Twitter. All right, down at the bottom, you'll see the more button. You can select embed tweet and it's essentially going to give you the code that you need. Let's go ahead and copy it by just hitting copy code and just paste that over the placeholder text. So when you run it, you will see the tweet embedded. Could not be easier, okay? This is a great way to get other types of media and information embedded into your project and tie all of your accounts together. Your, um, you're not limited to Twitter. This, this is like I said, you can use this for videos, like buttons, so many other things. Very nice job on this. If you have any questions, leave it in a comment. Nice job, everyone.